，欢迎大家来到一个新的视频。那么今天我们又要干嘛呢？嘚，花钱。今天我们花四百五十块钱让 Joe Creator 在 Fiverr 上面分析一下火星生意。马帮子。啊呸！腾哥儿，腾哥的天堂，你们有听过天堂吗？你们知道天堂的什么？来发给弹幕。Let me know when you know. 首先都花了这个四百五十块钱，求你们可以点个赞吗？你摆票了吧？我去，走。But I think these are called an an eru. A what? Oh, eru. I'm not sure about that though. But sort of traditional Chinese instrument. I think where it's interesting because the bow goes between the two strings. Let's see if we can see that. Is that right? It doesn't look like it is there. Maybe I'm wrong. 你们来说，它到底是对还是不对 ？Strings look a little bit thick for it. I'm not sure, so、uh, somebody can teach me and correct me on what this instrument might be. You may have seen that behind that dog, he's half asleep. Sorry, 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 Shock, but in a great way. Oh my! Wow! Wow! <laughs> oh, nice. Good progression. Very sort of harmonic minor sort of、uh, feeling there. 帅，这真的好帅，这光头也太帅了。不是说光头啊，光头能帅这个是很难。我爸我觉得他蛮帅的，因为我知道他之前不是也有头发嘛，他头发有帅，但是现在是 like wow， 嗯，再帅一点。我也在考虑要不要剃光。Now the verse comes in. So I guess he's going to be describing his homeland here. He's very careful on how he's、uh, how he's not just singing it, but how he's feeling it. And even his even his face looks really happy in sort of in how careful he's being and and how he's singing these、uh, singing these lines, singing these adjectives. 这声音超好听，对不起啊，我没有在听酒的话，酒说的话太多了，我现在就是想听这首歌。哎呦，你个姑娘 ！And you have this sort of walking bass as well. Wow, I wasn't expecting that. It's almost like shouting, but still, still very dynamic. I really, that's impressive. Keep such good pitch, and it be so shouty at the same time. 对，我觉得这个是一个重点。他能控制的这么好听，又那么大声，而且你有没有发现他麦克风越来越远？哎，我也可以分析啊，他麦克风越来越远，因因为他能这样子，不能让人家噗，就是
你听这个的时候，你的毛毛不起来，就是有问题了。It also really, it just it contrasts the music in the background, which is very soft. At this point, it's very relaxed. the The strings are relaxed to them, and the piano is as well. His vocal really, really pushes through. And you can tell he, you can tell he means it 100. So much emotion there. And those Eru were really nice sounding there as well. So we have some really like slow drums coming through. It's still really, really relaxed, and his voice is the only thing that really pushes through. The drums are lazy and flowing, and there's so the strings behind. Ooh! Oh, you even got some brass in the background now. I wonder, was he? Is he wearing some traditional sort of clothes as well to Mongolia? Or it looks like it. It's very sort of smart. This, we, you, 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 Even that, I love this sort of thing as well. When he goes in here, it's all it's all falsetto, super high, and then he comes down with a with a crunchy. Uh... Really strong falsetto, actually. Impressive, that is really good. Band sounds great behind him now as well. Oh, that's so cool. Brave. Again, the way he shouts with such pitch and. So you know, so much control is really good. Very impressive. Wow, you're so shy. Awesome. Oh, I love the end. Nice, everything finished together nicely. Great crescendo. Okay, wow, well, that was really good. Obviously, we had all the all the lyrics across the bottom the whole way around. It's, it's self-explanatory. It's not trying to do anything clever, but everything that he's written, just the way he performs it, he may just be talking about a green field and no, and a nice little nice landscape or whatever of his of his home his hometown of his home nation. This song is just I I heard heard about this behind the scenes. 故事嘛，然后后面就是不是再改了一次嘛？能看到他的表情，你是 ，you know like he's really feeling， it, 你感觉得到他真的 best。这个比看什么节目、看什么电影都帅，因为你你你 ，you see somebody in their element， you see somebody doing what they're supposed to do， I guess。But It's the way he performs it. It's kind of a bit disassociated from the from the rest, right? But he's injecting the traditionalism into his sort of composed performance that comes later on. That song is too good. I feel like I should listen to Nemo's song. 
I wonder if there would be a way to entwine this even even further into what he's trying to do instead of having it separately at the start. But obviously what he's done here is fine as well. I mean, even there you can see he's just taking it in. And it sounds quite... Yeah, that's so nice. ...grained to me. But I think it'll have it sound a lot more, a lot more normal, more acquainted with this style of singing. Obviously, you know, it takes a lot of skill as well and everything, I yeah. guess, to be able to do it. But it sounds like wow. You can do But when you listen to it, just the instrument and its singing together, the sound is. The strongest bit for me is just his absolutely yeah. insane sort of grunt on his vocals. So raspy That's and strong. That's my favorite. It's like a dream. He can do everything. So what did I think? The intro was really interesting, surely very impressive. I just wish there was, there was sort of more of it to, to yeah. come. It, it sort of gets put on the front and then uh, and I'd like to hear more of it maybe reintroduced at the end or, or whatever. I really like the crescendo he did though. The band back him up really nicely. The composition's really good. There's a few nice little twiddly bits in there, like the climb of the strings before the big chorus. His sort of passion is just absolutely what carries yeah. it and um, it wouldn't really matter um, whether you like the style of music or not you have to respect his energy and his passion I mean even there he's got a big smile on his face and everything yeah. so uh, great performance definitely yeah thanks for watching and goodbye like that kind of vibe that's my favorite that was crazy they're so into it you know you see the passion when they're doing the best at what they're supposed to be doing, that's cool. That's what I think. And that's what I think. Ah, that's what I think. And that's what I think. Find out what you're doing best and keep doing that. If you haven't yet, please give us a like. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, if you have any other questions, please tell us in the comments. Bye bye!